The top Houthi negotiator, Mohammed Abdul Salam, claimed that Sana'a delegation's meeting with Saudi leaders helped in elimination of fundamental obstacles to the UN peace plan for Yemen. This report has more. Top Houthi negotiator and spokesman Mohammed Abdul Salam said the meeting held by the Sana'a delegation with Saudi leadership helped overcome the major obstacles that were hindering the UN roadmap for peace in Yemen. As Hans Grunberg, the UN envoy to Yemen, is trying to ensure the success of the roadmap, the Houthis are waging a battle against Western forces in the Red Sea. The Houthis reason that they are supporting Gaza by stopping Israeli ships from crossing the Bab al-Mandab Strait. Saudi diplomacy and its mediation efforts have created an unprecedented opportunity to start ending the crisis in Yemen. The chief negotiator said the peace path in Yemen is going along well, and has been so since the nationwide truce took effect in April 2022 and through the many sponsored talks with Saudi brothers. When asked if the Houthis were willing to begin political negotiations that included sharing power, holding elections, voting on a constitution, and completing the political process, he responded that the roadmap covered the concerns of all parties and the humanitarian crisis that Yemenis are experiencing. He explained that tackling the humanitarian file will pave the way for political dialogue. The UN roadmap already covers dialogue and humanitarian issues, such as the reopening of roads, airports, and ports, and the release of prisoners. In response to Western statements that Red Sea attacks will impact the peace efforts in Yemen, he stated that the aim of the attacks is clear. They are a response to the pressing situation in Palestine, which is a threat to regional Arab and Islamic peace.